Hey guys and welcome back to Pokemon Ash Grey Edition. So I have a bit of a disclaimer. I didn't record a bit, but I've realised quite early on that I wasn't recording. We made it a bit through Victory Road. Uh, Victory Road. Viridian Forest. We made it a bit way through Viridian Forest, and I came back. So the only thing that you've missed is the capture of Weedle being Sting, and then adding him to the team, evolving him to Kakuna. And I've done a bit of grinding and got Kakuna to level 9 and Static to level 9. So Static does have Thundershot, Growl, Tail Whip and Thunder Wave. While Sting has Poison Sting, String Short and Harden of course because he is a Kakuna. Now before we get going back into Viridian Forest, I am going to heal myself just up. I should have done it before the episode. Do apologise. It'll only take a few seconds and there we go. Right. Now let's make our way up to Viridian Forest. And things have changed from Fire Red. And leaf green edition for one it is actually a maze and it's huge and it's not the same layout either pokemon have not changed though um and i'm not gonna battle you so they're all, all the trainers that we're probably going to encounter um have been encountered already so i do apologize for that um i couldn't go back i hadn't made a save early enough on my system. So, I'll oh, go on. Pikachu, use your Thundershock. Show them what you can do. You can half arsedly kill a Caterpie. Let's go. Here we go. Right, I, th I think I remember it being this way. I can't completely remember. The only time that I'm uh, going to battle is if I can catch you, to be honest. Let's make this through. No, I don't need to fight you yet. I think we're up this way. I'm not too sure. So many encounters. I think we're this way. Oh, there's a Pokeball over there. So maybe it's this way. See, I told you I got lost. It is an absolute maze. Uh, like it should be. It was very easy on Viridian. Uh, Viridian Forest was very easy on Fire Red and Leaf Green. It was an exact copy of like Red, Blue, and Yellow as well. I think they changed it up in most of the other games. Like every other game after that had an alternative version, but. Let's go get that item that we've just seen. Oh, we have to go down that way to get it. Okay, she heals up our Pokemon, which is amazing. And then this was as far as I got before reading that we, uh, I wasn't recording. So, pressing on. Oh, there's a house over there. With another trainer. Oh, hello. Greetings, I'm addressing the Pokemon trainers who came from Pallet Town. Then I have found you at last. I am Samurai. Let's have a Pokemon match and see who Trump triumphs. Oh, I remember this dude. He was really weird. Like, he he had to... Uh, he trained them very, like... In, like, military style. And I think he's going to kick my ass. Because I am not ready for a pincer. Oh! Hell no, am I not ready for a pincer? Oh, he's already here. Okay. Oh. Oh my god. Static, no. Okay, go on, Sting. You got this. I'm just going to spam this because Sting Shot just takes so long. Oh, and he's down. Ooh, if we beat this battle, Sting evolves. Hell yeah, who we got? Met. Praise be the Metapod, the unholy battle. If we only had Harden, this battle would have been... Oh, we poisoned him as well. Oh, hell yeah. He has Tackle. But, yeah, I can take it. I believe Sting is going to evolve now. Level 10, if I'm correct. Ooh, nearly level 11. Sting's being the MVP of the... Yep, here we go. Sting is evolving. It was perfect idea to bring a Weedle onto the team. We needed something else other than Pikachu that was strong enough and I knew that these evolved really quickly. And I do prefer Beedrill over Butterfree, so I'm going to snip away from the storyline slightly because I know we had a Butterfree. But I'm assuming we're going to get a Butterfree as part of that, you know, for that encounter with the... with whatever, but we'll see. Oh, a Fury Attack. Cool. A Beedrill swap... Oh, I remember. Yep, yeah, let's get inside his house. What the hell's this? I found one antidote. Oh, that'll do. I hope you learned your lesson, novice. 
You're letting that Weedle escape almost cost us our lives. Other trainers from Pallet Town would have never been so irresponsible. I have three matches with Pallet Town trainers. Those trainers really knew how to raise a Pokemon. Though I lost, I have never been trained to face the next trainer from Pallet Town, but you've proved me to be the only novice. Now rest your Pokemon and leave my cabin. Whoa. What? We didn't... Alright guys, um... So... Oh. Oh. This is a scene that was missed out, that is being re-added, because I didn't have a um, Metapod at the time, so... This is really weird, because... Basically, the recording has failed, and you're going to find out in a couple of episodes, so this is really back to... The, oh, I'm so confused, because this was during the time when I was redoing the series because I lost the save file two episodes in and I was like ah, I really want to show this so I'm now regrinding back up having to remember like nicknames and stuff so y you'll notice that I won't have Peckers or Squirm named like this because it didn't happen like that um, but I didn't realize that holding a Metapod would activate this scene so I wasn't recording at the time because it was so quick that a Beedrill flew in and took squirm um, and went into the uh, hut what we've just been in came out and as you'll know now this is where we're up to so I'll carry on with the video and we'll fight this see if we can catch it and if we do just continue with the video carry on everything will be back to normal at the end of that next video okay right so I'm gonna try and capture this no, I'm not, because I've got my own sting now, so we are going to try and beat this. I'm going to bring Squirm out, because it's going to be really meta. Um, that Oh, Squirm's level 10, and he didn't evolve. Oh, he got rid of... Oh, oh go on. How did we get rid of Poison? Um, oh, I don't want him to die. So I'm going to bring out Static. You'll notice they're a lot higher level as well because I realised how under leveled I was on the first playthrough. So, please excuse my current gameplay and welcome back to the previous episode without previous Connor knowing anything about this. So, we're not out of Radium Forest yet. Oh, wait, we didn't get the item. I want to go back for the item, and then we do. Oh, we need to have a look at our new fully evolved Sting. The bug poison with the hasty nature. He has swarm, so it ups bugs move in a pinch. And we do have hard and fury attack sting shot and now poison sting as well. Okay. So oh, I don't know where the uh beetles are gonna be coming from. But we need to go back for the item. Oh we can't! Oh yeah, it was this way. We are going the right way. Cool. And we have a trainer to file. Random Pidgeys. They're in the forest. Mostly Weedles. I am going to train up Pikachu a bit while we're here. It only takes me a couple of seconds. Oh. Can you heal me again? Or is that was that my one and only chance? Oh. There we go. Oh, that's nice. Don't come here, novice. I beat you. Okay. I'm going to run and face this trainer. Here we go. Did you see that Beedrill swarm before? I could hear the buzzing all the way out here. No, I didn't see the Beedrill swarm. I got a Beedrill though, which I hope you're ready for. He's got a Metapod. So we got Static that's going to take him down. Ooh! Nearly, literally took him straight down. Yeah, we're going to keep out uh, Static. He needs to level up a bit more. Getting the crits on my Pikachu, man. Cool, we're level 10. Yeah, I'm going to switch out Sting. Oh, I love his little sprite. That's so cute. Right, Fury attack this bitch. Twice? Is that it? Oh, three times. One more. Yeah, level 11 already for Sting. Quite surprised about that. But... Hey ho. Nice. Let's get out of Viridian Forest. <laughs> that is something I'd like to complete today. <sighs> Leaving Viridian Forest? Hell yes. I can't wait till we can hack these down. What's over here? Flinch Rock Shop. Rock souvenirs. Stay out there. Okay. 
Pure City is grey, the colour of stone. This stone has always been famous for stone. The name's Flint, and you're standing on some of my merchandise, young man. These rocks are Pewter City souvenirs. Wanna buy some? I can buy hard stuff. Oh, that's a cool place. I don't have any rock Pokemon, but... Yeah, you really think you can beat him? I'm going to attempt to. I mean, I'm new to this. Is there anything behind you down here? Oh, against this rock? No. Sometimes they have items hidden on rocks and stuff. Yay, Pewter City! Find the Pokemon Center. Whew. Hell yeah. I'll show you what the uh, Pokemon team's looking like back in the box, because you'll have missed some of these guys. So we, we've got Kenya the Spearow, Tooth the Rattata, and Pekka the Pidgey, and also Volt Metapod and Squirm Cappy on the side benches. Just, I don't know why they're there. I think I put them out in a rush, but I'm going to move them over to their correct spots. That's nice. Cool. Let's uh, see if these guys have got anything to say. No, I, I'm basically seeing, seeing if they've given give me any free items. Tell me about yourself. I'd love to hear your profile. Oh, I didn't mean to do this. Ah, oh, that'll do. I'm a Pokemon friend. Okay. And what's this? There's a video telephone. <laughs> You're thinking of entering the Pokemon Regional Championships? Huh? You don't even have any badges. You're a long way from entering. I've literally just started my journey. Can we cut me some slack? Like... <sighs> right. So this is the gym. I don't really want to take on Brock just yet. Oh god, we've got to go through Mount Moon and everything. Oh, what's up here? Anything around here? Oh, there's a single house. I'm sure we can... Oh, how do I get to it? Oh, I've got to go this way. Cool. What is this house? Who are you? Hello there, young gun. I'm the tough Tim. I raise my Pokemon to be tough and only as they can be. If you'd like, I can toughen up a Pokemon for you for the price of just one yellow star. Shard. Um, okay. I remember about that with the yellow shard, if we do get any. Well, uh, I never wonder about... Oh, hello. Billy, I'm Billy Brock's brother. Oh, this is... My brother's at the gym. Oh, wow. I forgot that Brock had, like, seven or eight sisters and brothers. How many have you got? One, two, three, four, five, six... Have you ever played with a Geodude? Oh, okay. I don't know how we're going to beat Brock unless he genuinely gets wet in the... Uh... I'm going to talk to them all, just in case one of them does give me something. Right, cool. Have a little wander around the village. We haven't got any enough money, I don't think, for potions or anything along those lines. Oh, what's this house? Can we go and swim? Oh, the current's too strong to swim. Okay. This is like the power plant, I'm assuming. It's been a long time since I watched the anime, so if I am missing out on anything... So, there we go. Okay. I think we, we're going to have to take the gym on. I think that's the only thing we've got left, unless a good amount moon without taking on the gym. I'm yeah. Oh! Who's this? Flint, hold on a second, kid. You're not leaving without facing Brock, are you? I thought you said you had what it takes to beat him. We'll get to it then. Oh, oh. Yep, 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 sure. Let me, uh. Let me go take on Brock then. Okay. Okay, it's just Brock? Who goes there? My name is Brock and I'm the leader of this Pokemon gym. This is your first gym battle and that Pikachu is your Pokemon. Your Pikachu is the cutest stage. I can't wait. I can't win. As a gym leader, I have to accept every challenge, so let's get this over with. Cool. I don't really know what Pikachu is going to be able to do. He's just, has he just got the Yonix? Yep. Yeah. Level 14. Okay. We're going to have to stick Sting in here. And he's gonna. Oh, we are not ready for this fight. Yep. Wait, Thundershock's effective? Okay. Um. Yeah, he's, he's killed me. Cool. Stop. I don't want you to hurt your Pikachu. Let's call this a draw. Wait, what? Ash is out of Pokemon. Player lost. Okay. I paid it. It's a weird draw. 
if I lose and have to pay. You both were not strong enough to pose a threat to me. Come back when you've grown. Wait, my Pokemon completely dead? How does this work? Oh, he's healed them back up. Okay. Uh... Oh, this is part of the story I remember. Come with me. What are we doing? Oh, we're going to we're going down here. Okay. Ever loses sometimes. You can't let that get you down. Brock is very good. His talents could take him much further than just being a local gym leader. But Brock has nine little brothers and sisters to take care of. So if he could never leave the town for regional championships, his good-for-nothing father left the family to become a Pokemon trainer and they never heard from him again. His heartbroken mother tried to be her best to hold things together, but she sadly passed away. God. Brock's the only one of his little brothers and sisters have left. Hmm, so you think you can beat Brock? I may just know a way that I can supercharge our Pikachu. This is the town's hydroelectric plant. Follow me. Wait, we're cheating here. The river turns the wheel to generate electricity. I believe that the generator had some excess power at the time, and it formed itself into a high-energy ball. I'm sure the ball could give your Pikachu a power boost. Here, take it. The light ball. The items. With that light ball, your Pikachu should have a shot at taking out Brock. Good luck, kid. You'll need it. Okay. We got a light ball. Where's that then? What's this do? A puzzling orb that could be held by Pikachu. It raises the attack and special attack stats. So let's see what it is now. And then once we've given it. So it's 15 and 17. Let's have a look with. Cool. It's just 15 and 17. <laughs> it's not changed at all. Cool. I'm assuming it's part of the story so that we can, uh, with the light ball, it can actually take down. Unless it doesn't change on the stats. Never mind. I don't know. Should we have a, another go? Cool. Haven't you learned your lesson yet? Your Pikachu is no match for me. You may think you're ready to take and challenge me, but I can tell you're still a novice. As you know, I must accept all challenges, so let's get this over with. Let the match begin. I mean, let... The light ball? Let's give it a go. So that... Geo, dude? Ooh, he started to do a bit of damage, actually. Oh, electricity was weakened. I'm going to thunder wave him. Just because. God, I'm still a crap trainer against him. That's not going to do a lot of damage. Defense fell. Poison sting. All the way. My original playthrough of blue, when I was like six or whatever, I literally beat Brock with a Cappy and String Shot. Because I got his accuracy that down, and then I just poison stinged him to death, and it was just, it was the most cheese way of winning, but it was the only way I could figure out how to win. Oh, we can't poison him, can we? Oh, he's gonna kill us, please don't kill us, we're so close! Oh! We beat his Geo, dude. Where was his Onyx? Oh, yeah, he let us win, didn't he? Huh? Pikachu's electricity has set off the sprinklers? No matter, let's finish this match. Leave Onyx alone. Our brother worked hard to raise it, you big bully. Oh, God. Stop it, all of you. This is an official match, and we're going to finish it no matter what. Let the match commence. Oh, what? This is so cool. But... I need... Pikachu's not alive. And we lost. Let's go back. I'm hoping it keeps... Right. We have to start from scratch, but I like this. This is cool. There we go. I'm going to try and 
quickly get through this bit. Oh yes, we're going to be alive. That's cool. As long as we're alive, I just want to see if it, if it like absolutely owns him like it does in the original anime. Cool. Yeah, we've seen this bit. Right. It sends out his onyx. Still not doing amazing amounts, and we've only we've oh dear. Let's just thunder wave it to help out Sting. And then he's gonna string shot it. Oh, it's his speed that it brings down. <laughs> oh, we're still gonna have to like grind a tiny bit, I think, in between this and the next episode. So yeah. We are so not ready to beat Brock yet, and we're just losing money. Cool. Well, that's something for me to do in between episodes. Thank you very much for watching episode two. If you did enjoy, like it. Uh, please do like it. And subscribe if you want to continue with this series. I've been Barbara B, and I'll see you later, guys.